friends welcome to gadgets india so here in this channel i'll share you all the latest tech uh, gadgets which you can use in your day to day life and uh, which you can buy without being biased and with lot of assurance because i will do an exhaustive review of each and every gadget here in this channel so that you don't need to be worried about what will happen if i buy that particular gadget or what will happen if uh, the kind of expectation which i am having from this particular gadget is not being delivered so without further delay let's start this first unboxing and review of this product which is a bluetooth speaker having nfc brand name sublime 2 imported by potronics so let's open it As you see, the packaging is uh, pretty neat. Black, Portronix logo on the side. Sublime two. It shows uh, imported by Portronix Digital. So, in this side, it shows what are the features of this particular gadget. So, it has Bluetooth four point zero, NFC. If you have NFC with your handset or mobile device or any other tablet, then it is compatible for that. it has inbuilt fm radio it has mobile hand free connection facility then it has led display which i think will be displaying at this side that means the front of the uh, speaker depicting which mode or uh, maybe uh, this uh, fm channel then uh, micro sd card slot aux in so that without using bluetooth you can use this auxiliary cable to get the uh, song being played over here rechargeable battery and usb port for charging it so let's open it let's open this side pretty tough packing okay let's put the packing this side so we get this user manual this is standard user manual let's keep it the side now there are two cables one auxiliary in cable to be used this is otg cable so that you can use your uh, uh, pen drive if you have some songs you can take this device with you while uh, going somewhere and if you have some uh, option like your pen drive is there and it has some songs and in case your uh, battery of the mobile is uh, out and uh, you need to play the songs you don't need to use this mobile you can use that pen drive right directly to this let's keep it this side now the device nice packaging okay good so this device is in black color so let me share you regarding this price of this device in different uh, e-commerce marketplace so i got this device from snapdeal at a price range of 199 which is the lowest i'll share the description so this uh, in my uh, description of this particular video below so you can see that and uh, in uh, uh, amazon it's uh, some 2049 and in uh, flipkart it's 2300 something so uh, that means uh, snapdeal is the uh, cheapest offering uh, website for this particular gadget so let's see what's uh, there in the back side so it's aux in for the auxiliary cable it has a micro sd card slot and this is to usb charging point it's not a usb type c it's usb uh, regular which uh, you can use your uh, old phone handset uh, charger uh, charge pin having usb uh, charging facility so you can use that pin for charging this device and there is a very small hole over here as you can see it is uh, i think it's an indicator for this uh, uh, charging of the device uh, while uh, this is being plugged in So now here I think it's a battery uh, case. Yes. So it has a 2000 mAh, 3.7 volt battery, and uh, I don't think uh, yeah it's made in China. Uh, there is no branding on this battery. It's just a rechargeable battery. 
so I hope this battery will last long now let's switch on the device if there is some juice in this well, before switching on you can see there are a couple of uh, uh, marks over here on the top surface it's pretty uh, matte finish and it's rubber kind of texture of this uh, surrounding it's a one rubber kind of uh, uh, covering which is wrapping around this four sides of this uh, uh, box and uh, this side is a wire mesh and this is also a rubber texture but this is one single rubber as you can see this is one single rubber and this is uh, uh, textured uh, nicely so that it is having a good grip and on the uh, floor itself having placed it it's not moving that way so there is no tumbling issue of this so here this is uh, volume down volume up this is previous this is next this is play pause and also it's power button here this one is for the mode now let's press the power button you have to press it for some time like two seconds now it's on so now it's showing FM mode. Let me reduce the volume. So as you can see, when I reduce this uh, volume button by pressing, it's zero. Now by pressing up, it's one, two, three, like this. Now it's showing 92.7. So 92.7 is now the channel tuned to. Now you can see the M. So let's see whether this M is uh, working nicely or not. I'm pressing it once. It's showing line that means aux and auxiliary cable you can use. Second time pressing. Bluetooth. This is showing Bluetooth mode. Now let me pair uh, this device with uh, my tablet. Let me just do it. So as you can see, I'm pairing my Samsung Galaxy uh, a Note 10.1 uh, tablet to this. Uh, device so now it's showing sublime so let's tap it so i have also one sublime 3 being paired that's why it's showing previously so now it's uh, sublime is in paired it's been connected to the phone and media audio so now let's uh, play some music over here Now I have paired this device with uh, my Samsung Galaxy Note 10.1 as you can see over here it's paired the symbol is showing paired now the device is paired now let me play one video over here the audio quality is good so let's go back to FM mode now FM mode is good so now let me see how the channel change is happening so as you can see here I'm reducing the volume a little bit so there are previous and next button let me just press it once the next one it's automatically tuning the channel so as you can see 92.7 to 93.5 and the audio quality is pretty uh, I will not say it's very great in terms of receiving capacity but uh, bit of distortion is happening in terms of the audio let me just press it again for a new other channel it's tuning manually 94.3 as you can see but here there's some distortion is happening now it's good here it's good here it's good Let's go to the some other channel. So I think it's missing a couple of channels where you have to do manual tuning. So how to do the manual tuning? 
let me just show you we have to press it hard and leave it and press it again like this that means you have to press 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 and again one pressing it will start the tuning the second press it will stop here suppose i'll press once the tuning has start i'll press stop it stopped at 101.6 okay so this is all about this device i'll come back with extensive uh, comparative uh, analysis of this particular device in terms of the battery backup the signal the other features thank you for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe this video for more of such uh, new gadget review please subscribe the channel thank you